We're going to take a look at the Max Air fan. Now it can vent in or out. You typically definitely want to vent out while you're using the cooktop. You do not really want to use the Max Air fan while you have the AC running because you'll either be bringing hot air in mixing with the cold that will create moisture uh, or you'll just be venting out the cold air right back outside. But when you do want to utilize the Max Air fan, there's two options, controls directly on the fan itself and a remote. First, we're going to take a look at the direct buttons here at the fan. Uh, it's got an on off button, you press that. It's going to go ahead and go to its last setting. It's going to open and either be venting air in or air out. Um, now with the controls directly, you can't tell other than just placing your hand up there and feeling. Uh, so we're bringing air in at the moment. You can press this button where it just says in out and that's going to change the flow. And then you have plus and minus buttons. The words on it show open and close. However, the plus will increase the fan speed. The minus is going to decrease the fan speed. Now, once you have it open like this, there is a mode called ceiling fan mode. Uh, you manually take this lever and just close it all the way down. Now, once it's closed, the fan will go ahead and run and just circulate the air inside the camper for you. When you get ready to turn it off, you'd simply press the on off button again and it'll shut itself down. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the remote itself. Here with the remote, uh, it's going to look similar. You're going to have an on off button. You press that. It's going to go ahead, power up, open up to its very last setting that you had. Now the difference on the remote is it comes with a little screen and it's telling me now that right now air is going out. Speed is set for 50% and the lid is open. Now I can hit on the remote, uh, change that to air in. I can on the remote change the fan speed up and down. And the remote also has an auto feature. The auto feature is determined based on the set temp and room temperature. Now, what the Max Air Fan will try to do with that is if you say the room temperature is 76 degrees, you want it to be 74 degrees, it's going to try to determine to either vent that air out or bring outside air in to get it as close as it possibly can. However, it does not heat or cool that air. It simply tries to remove hot air from inside out or cool air from inside in or vice versa. Uh, of course, on the remote, same thing. When you're done utilizing it, you just press the on off button to go ahead and close the fan. Here on the Max Air Fan, uh, there may be times where you get a bug or just dust and want to get in there and clean everything out. Now, from the inside, what we do is turn these four pieces that are holding the screen in place. Once you've pulled those, you can just kind of pull the screen down and then you could take the screen outside, rinse it off with water, wipe it down. At this point, you can get up inside here and wipe any of the dust off of the fan blade. And then once you're done cleaning, you'd simply line the screen back up. Once it's back in place, you'll just re-secure the screen. And it's good until next time.